help having a psychology degree being in the beauty industry? How does that help you? Well, you know, um, my mother actually uh, studied psychology, and then I graduated with a psychology degree from Harvard. And uh, I have to tell you, it definitely helps me because when you understand people and, and understand that a lot people want the same thing, and that's a little bit more, um, then, and, you know, in this type of business, really it's about relationships and it's about relationships building. You know, of course we have great products and people love our concept, but they also love the fact that we want to build their businesses. So by having a psychology degree, that helps me really help um, the, the cosmetologists and help with the people that I deal with on a regular basis to understand them so I can get them the things that they want. Can you make the connection between a black woman's hair and her self-esteem. The connection between our hair and self-esteem is just tremendous because we know when we look good, we feel good. And when we feel good, we act better. So when our hair looks good, I mean, it's just something about that that just puts us in a totally different mood that makes us feel happy. And that's why oftentimes, you know, we as African Americans spend two to three times more on our hair than the other um, races. Is it true that the beauty industry really doesn't feel that brunt because people will do whatever it takes to feel good and look good even when things around them aren't so good? Being in a post-recession and within the hair industry, it does have some effects, but it doesn't have as, as large effects as some of the other um, industries do. You know, what happens with um, customers going to salons, maybe they used to go every week. Well, now they'll go every two weeks. But I can tell you one thing about beauty and about hair care. We are not going to stop doing our hair no matter what. What is your best advice to today's woman in corporate America? That's an excellent question. My advice to um, women in corporate America would be to be yourself. Um, have that confidence that you have the ability. Don't let anyone tell you what you cannot do. Decide on your own what can be done. Apply yourself. Have that faith. Work hard and you'll get it. Whatever it is that you want, you are able to get it. Because know that God didn't take time to make a nobody. You are somebody and you can do it. And one of the things that my father says is he says in our time and in our space and with the grace of God, you and I can Ursula make a Dudley difference. Ursula Dudley Oglesby, president of Dudley Beauty Corp LLC, and this is Rolling Out.